Let's look at how we make negative commands with reflexive verbs using the imperative. All we do is we take a statement with a reflexive verb that's in the negative using ne and pa or any other negative word and we take away the subject. Let's look at some examples. Tu ne te laves pas les mains. You don't wash your hands. Les mains being your hands and laver to wash. So if we want to say don't wash your hands, we just take away the tu at the beginning and it becomes ne te lave pas les mains. Don't wash your hands. The only other change we have here is that the S from love has disappeared. That's because we don't write an S for tu for ER verbs like laver. Let's look at some more examples. Vous ne vous douchez pas. You don't shower. To a group of people or a formal person. But if we want to say don't shower as a command, we just take away this vous at the beginning. So it becomes ne vous douchez pas. Don't shower. The verb still has to correspond to the subject vous. So it has to have that easy ending. Can't have any other ending because as a reflexive verb, the subject and the object are the same. So it's ne vous douchez pas, don't shower. If the verb, if the subject is nous, we can apply the same process. So with sentences like nous ne nous occupons pas des vaches, we don't take care of the cows, vache being cow, and s'occuper being to take care of, we can say, ne nous occupons pas des vaches. Let's not take care of the cows. As a note, with s'occuper, you always have to have this de between s'occuper and the thing that you're taking care of. So it's s'occuper des vaches, which is why in this sentence it becomes, ne nous occupons pas des vaches. Let's not take care of the cows. C'est tout.